Hi, Mac. We need to get out of here, and I've come up with a brand new plan. Well, Ginger Light, hear it. I've noticed that some parts of the fence are quite rusty, and I wondered if we could cut through it. Aye, that's a thought. We could use that old butter knife from one of the huts, and I'm sure there are some broken shears around somewhere. I reckon if you get me those, I'll be able to make some crude wire cutters, which may be just good enough to cut that rusty wire. Great idea, Mac. I'll go and get them, but I'll have to be careful of the dogs. this in here, Babs. Oh, sorry, Ginger. I don't know where that goes. You could ask Mac. She's in Ot 17, you know. I managed to avoid the dogs and find the other blade you need. Aye, that's brilliant. Well done, Hen. Now placing the bolt I already have through the centre of the two whilst crossing them in a 90 degree fashion like so give her a wee bit of a tweak and hey presto! Wire cutters. They look great. I hope they'll be strong enough. Well remember it'll only work on the rusty fence wire. Oh yes, thanks Mac. Now, I have to be able to get through the fence to get things for our next escape attempt. But what then, Hen? Well, it's a bit extreme, but if we could disguise ourselves so that the dogs don't recognise us, then we'll be able to get out of here. I think we may be able to dress up as Mrs Tweedy. Do you think it's possible? Hmm. Sounds like a tall order to me. I can't work miracles, but we might pull it off. If you can find some poles, some boots, some gloves, but the key element is Mrs Tweedy's long dress. If I were you, I'd check round the back of the farmhouse. Okay, you work out the details and I'll get everything you need. Babs will be great for this. She's over in Hut 16 and we'll make the disguise there. Right, I'll take the things over there. Make sure she knows the plan. Oh, <laughs> 
Right. That's everything. At last we'll be able to escape from this farm. Should we tell the Tweedies in case they wonder where we are? Of course not, Babs. It has got to be done in secret. In secret? What fun! But will we tell the other chickens? <laughs> Oh, 
Mac, I know our old plan was less than perfect. Aye, Hen. We need a new plan. This time I have a number of escape ideas. Oh, I'm impressed. Let's hear them. OK. Which plan do you want to talk about? Well, my first idea is to make a seesaw and launch us over the fence. Hmm. To make a seesaw, we could easily find something for that. However, we're going to need a big weight to drop onto the seesaw and jettison us over the fence. You find the weight then. I think the best place to collect the pieces is in Hut 11. OK, that sounds great. OK, which plan do you want to talk about? Mr Tweedy has bought some fireworks. I'll bet we could use those to launch us out of here. That sounds a wee bit dangerous. I'll need to do some projectile calculations to get us over the fence. We will obviously need some fireworks and a box of matches to light them. Yes. And I have an idea of where to get them. As this could be dangerously explosive, I think we should store them all with Babs and Hut 16. Yes, that probably is the safest place. You better warn them to be ready. OK. Which plan do you want to talk about? I have a plan to build a catapult. Hmm, sounds familiar. I thought we'd tried that before. Yes, but from that we've learnt some lessons. We could try again. Make a bigger one. What do you think? Let's see. Uh, maybe... In fact, one of my original ideas was for a much larger catapult, and on reflection it's probably the better plan. We'll need an old pram, a tennis racket, a ladder, and some string. I also need to find a spoon to dig under the fence where it's soft and muddy. Once you've explored more of the farm and collected the things, where will you hide them? I think that Hut 15 will be just the place. OK, which plan do you want to talk about? Well, away with you, Ginger, and good luck. Thank you. 
ready to make the catapult? Yes, Ginger. I know what I have to do. Well done. I just hope I can find everything. I'll be back here as soon as I can. Your baby doll. We need objects from around the farm. Sleep tight, Angel Face. The rug's on the case. Looking tired of making minuscule profits. Thank <laughs> you. 
Hey! Rocky, did you manage to get anything? Hey, good things come to those who wait, Dullface. Rocky, you're here. Well, how about that? We need objects from around the edge of the farm. Sleep tight, Angel Face. The rug's on the case. Well, how about that?
anything. Relax, we're making progress. Oh, great. You're welcome. Look at this. It's perfect for the catapult. Well done, Ginger. You know, I'm really looking forward to this. Great. We might actually be able to get out of here this time. I'll keep looking. Rocky, you're here. Well, how about that? We need objects from around the edge of the farm. Sleep tight, Angel Face. The rug's on the case. Yo, baby doll. Rocky! Last, I found everything you need. Brilliant! That will finish things off nicely. Is the catapult ready to go? Yes, it's outside facing the lake now.
you enough of the rock for me to give you a bronze medal. This completes what you need, Babs. Oh, thank you, Ginger. I'm getting a bit nervous. Don't worry. you love it. And we'll all be free at last. All right, then. It'll be nice to see a few fireworks, won't it? Here's the big weight you wanted. Brilliant! We're ready to go! And go we will. All of us. Come on!
chaps over the fence. Have a bronze medal. Have you been able to do the drawing since we talked to Fowler about the old crate from his RAF days? I only wish we'd listened to his daring war stories more carefully. Fowler's provided the answer. Who needs Rocky anyway? Well, hey, I've been working on my calculations. And I think the idea of a flying machine will work. Excellent. I knew we'd be able to fly out of here. Let's see it. Well, here are my plans for the old crate. It has to be big to hold us all, but I've broken it down into three main components. We'll have to get all three built and working before we can fly over the fence. To freedom! Oh, I can almost feel that grass under my feet. Firstly, we'll need a big engine. Well, I guess we have two options. Either Mr Tweedy's car, or his old tractor in the barn. Well, I think the tractor is more suitable, and we'd never get into his car. It's a bit old, and hasn't been running for some time, so I guess we'll need to oil it well. Then we can drive the prop shaft from this, so we'll need a decent length of chain. Yes! This could actually work! I'll see what I can do. OK, we'll assemble the engine in Hot 15. But what about the main body of the old crate? I figured out we should be able to convert one of the huts. Hut 10 would be good. What will it involve? Nice plan, Hen. We'll need some cogs, some tools and planks of wood. OK. That should be no problem. But this is going to take time. And we mustn't be caught by Mr Tweedy. We'll need a lookout. Do you think you could get hold of his binoculars? Yes. They must be in the farmhouse somewhere. Have you worked out how we can build the wings? Oh, aye. We'll need some poles, twine and lots of laundry. Sounds like a good plan, Mac. We can build these in hut 11. We need an awful lot. Can I help you in? No. You coordinate the plan. I know a couple of rats who do this kind of stuff for a living. Problem is, they'll need paying. I know. Those rats always want eggs. Well, I'll go and see Bunty in Hut 2. She'll be well chuffed that she can help.
silver bear, my lad. I shall give you this well-deserved silver medal. Hello? It's Attila. The hen. How can we help you, love? We have to get out of here and we need these things. Oh, I'm sure we can uh, come to some arrangement. Because we're desperate, I'm prepared to offer you six eggs. I think I must be dreaming. This is a big job, so uh, six eggs in advance will do nicely. I thought you'd say that, so I've got them here. Very nice. Good doing business with you, miss. We'll get just what you need. Meet later, back here. And make sure you don't forget anything. Well, here she is. Well, here she is. Merchandizo. They're Spanish. What did you manage to get? A box of the finest tools. An oil can. And a box of cogs, as you asked. That's fantastic. Brilliant work. Reward us well. Give us eggs. And we will always deliver. You really have this time. Thanks. Thank you. 
Stuff hen. They're assembling the engine in Hot 15. I'll take this over there now. This is heavy. It looks it. Well done, Ginger. I'm halfway there now. Brilliant. I only wish I trusted those rats. Found this. Is it for you? No, sorry, I'm making the wings, so I don't need that. Perhaps you could show Mac or have another look at your plans.
This should help you. Great. Max says we need an engine. Do you think we'll find one? My plan is to use the one from Mr. Tweedy's old tractor. Flippin' heck. Look at this list, Fetcher. I'm looking, Nick, I'm looking. This is dangerous work, miss, and no mistake. Dangerous or not, can you help us? Of course, if we're risking our tails and whiskers for you, love. Oh dear, I don't like the sound of this. We'll need at least six eggs. More like ten for this one, wouldn't you say, Fetcher? Ten? I'll give you six eggs now and no more. All right, miss. After you, Fetcher. After I what? Bring everything back here. We haven't much time. Well, here she is. Huh! <laughs> 
Âu lược. We're back! And we've got the lot! All of it? Yes, miss. Laundry, twine... And a lovely pair of these things. They're binoculars, you Nancy. Well done, both of you. That's all right, love. You can rely on us. Once we've got some eggs inside us. I think you actually deserve them. Thanks. I found Mac. This will be great for helping to convert Hut 10. Are we still on track? I've heard more noises coming from the barn. Yes. Mr. Tweedy's nearly fixed the pie machine. We are rapidly running out of time. There you are. I hope this will help it along. Fantastic! I only need one more item now. I know. Those wretched rats keep asking for more eggs. If only we could manage without them.
Well, this is just what you need. Great stuff. Only one more to get. Keep working. I'll be back soon.
Are you sure you need all this? Poles, chain... And an engine. It could be an impossible mission. But you have to accept it. How much is it worth? I'll pay you two eggs. Oh, yes, please. Be quiet, Fetcher. Uh, eight eggs. Six. That's my final offer. Done. Lovely. Six eggs. Here you are. Oh, please, hurry. Totally sorted. Totally. What? You got it all? Yes, and your engine's waiting for you. Just where you need it. All part of the service, my love. We'll soon be out of here. Of course you will, miss. Birds of a feather flop together. Be quiet, you Norbert. I know that it cost us a lot of eggs, but it was worth it. Thanks, both of you. Now we've got everything we need. Fantastic! That's it. Let's see if we can get this engine running. We must. Time is rapidly running out.
I award you a gold medal. My goodness, we've got oil everywhere. I know. I'd like to try it again, though. You know, I'm surprised Rocky wasn't more helpful. Last, they've got everything we need. I know what we need. A rest. You must be tired out. Well done, Ginger. We should be ready to finish the wings now. Brilliant. I'm sure this plan will work. We'll soon be out of here for good. Goodness, I'm exhausted. Here's the last thing you need. Thanks, Ginger. I've almost finished now. I'm proud of you. Let me help so we can try it out.